I wanted to talk about a topic. Um, it used to be back in the olden days, like Time Spiral and the core sets, players would vote on what cards they would want to see reprinted. And they could, you know, go online, I guess like on the old website, and there was like a page and they can click on what. Uh, I, to I remember voting, and I always voted, and none of the stuff I voted on was like accepted. Or won, I guess, because like I'm a different type of uh, player than control, and control players, you know, are more likely to vote, I guess. So it's kind of like a divide of economic class, if you will, of magic players. The blue players who have it all, and then the red players who just want to get like a 2-1 jack pop right? Uh, and you used to be able to vote for cards that you wanted to see, which I felt was fantastic. I don't know what happened. I honestly don't know what happened. I felt like that would be the best way to engage your audience, is to have them vote, and then everyone could vote for Damnation, and Damnation could be a new set. And it would create like this kind of excitement, right? Uh, I do know that they did for Time Spiral and every core set I felt like until like maybe 8th edition or even 8th edition I f feel like we did some voting. And you just go on a website and you vote for the card, they give you a bunch of cards that you can pick and you vote for which one you want. Um, obviously Lightning Bolt, I have a feeling that one was voted in. But uh, I don't know what happened to that, I always liked the idea. Uh, voting for reprints and you can kind of tell by like what people actually want. So maybe they want a Snapcaster Mage, maybe they want a Liliana because they're a little too outrageous in price and people just vote for them in the next, well there's no more core set, but the next set and then they get reprinted in that set. Now you might be asking, well this seems like a terrible idea because what about draft, what about stability, what about all that stuff? Well, you know, they don't you don't pick a card at random, they give you a selection and then you can pick like which card that you want from that selection so they've probably vetted through that selection but something like Damnation, like I see, could see that being voted very heavily and that would or even um, Damnation over Snapcaster, I don't know who would win if they could only reprint one or Liliana, Snap and Damnation I would probably pick Snap the only reason I feel like Snap would need the reprint more is just see so much more play in the competitive formats. But I really like the idea of uh, voting for magic card reprints. Uh, that way you give the controller the base to tell wizards, hey I feel like this card is too much, let's reprint it. And that would also help wizards of coast sell the set, right? I mean if people were voting on the card to be reprinted they would probably be interested in buying it or trading for the card. So overall I, I don't really know why we don't do that anymore, um, but we don't. I would love to see it come back and I feel like it would be a very, it would be nice to uh, have that engagement with uh, Wizard of Coast, that direct interaction with them again. Bye guys!